Hello and welcome everyone to this penalty shootout in the final of this Qatar World Cup between Argentina and France. And if you ask me, I think Argentina will win this one. There is nothing who can stop Emi Martinez. He is really good and he is better than Hugo Loris for sure. For sure, hands down. He is one of those goalkeepers you want him to keep for you in the penalties. Like 9 out of 10 times he will save your shots. France, they are going to take the first shot and i hope they send someone who can actually shoot it's mbappe is going and i am i am really scared now he has connected two penalties tonight this is his third penalty in the penalty shootout please mbappe don't miss this one please yes he has he has connected one nail for france so the pressure is to Argentina. He connected that one. Leo Messi is going there to take the first shot for Argentina. And Loris is there. Loris, please save this one. Save this and save your country and win your country a World Cup. I think he will go to the left side of Loris. He will score. He will score this one. Oh, almost, almost. That's why his tongue is out. He almost guessed it. And who is going there right now? Pressure is immense. I don't expect anything from these players of France. I expect them to shoot them back to Paris is Coman Kingsley Coman wow I think he will miss this I think he will miss this see I told you he'll miss this I told you he'll miss this Emi Martinez is king he is the absolute king once again that's a really weak ass penalty if you are shooting a penalty so shoot that over because he's diving right but he just made a mess of it 1-1 one, one. who is going there Paulo Dybala Loris needs to save this one but I think he will score Dybala is quite good in penalties Loris I don't expect anything to save See, I told you, I don't expect any of the shots for Loris to save. I don't expect Loris to save anything tonight. <laughs> it's Argentina's final, it's Argentina's cup. They are winning this for sure. Who is going there? Chuameni, the Madridista. Man, the pressure is immense. Chuameni, <laughs> keep the respect of Madrid. Please, don't miss this. Please, Chuameni. Ah, he shot it outside. Uh, he shot the World Cup outside for France. That's why I'm telling you, I don't expect anything from France except that shot from Mbappé. Man, Chouamini, Chouamini. Ah, Paredes. Can Loris do something? Can Loris bring back France into the match? Can he do that? I think can't. Once again, he missed that. 3-1. 3-1. Just one shot. He just needs to save one shot. If Argentina can save this shot, they are winning the World Cup 2022. Can you believe that? Can you believe that? Loris can't save for shit, man. Everyone will blame Chuameni and Coman. Of course, they should get. But Loris, I don't think so. He is even good enough to be the goalkeeper of France. I don't think so. He is good enough. Moani, I think he will miss this one. This young kid, I, he is 24, 25 years old. It's too much pressure for this guy. He has scored. He has scored. But this shot in for Argentina. They are winning the World Cup. All the shots should have been like that one. Loris can't do anything. Loris is not a good goalkeeper. I have been saying this for a long time. Is there not a better goalkeeper than Loris? See, I told you. They have won it. They have won it. They have won it. They have won the World Cup. Argentina have won the World Cup. That's 1978. Congratulations. Congratulations to Messi, to Argentina for winning the World Cup. Unbelievable. This France team, the amount of time they have come back, it's enough to say they have done well. They have tried their level best. Messi has won. The campaign has worked. The PR media has worked. As I said before the match started, doesn't matter what happens tonight, this man, this man is still the GOAT. Soon! He is still the GOAT, the greatest player of all time. But it's totally up to France. Not enough. Not enough. Disappointing because the first 80 minutes, they had zero shots on target. Then in the last 10 minutes of the match, they woke up and did something that's why they came back into the match then once again they went into hibernation in the first of the extra time then for some parts in the second half of the extra time then once again they got the third goal back but Muani for the last shot he was selfish and he just shot that ball straight to Emi Martinez and I don't believe this France was so bad I don't know why Aguirre is there <laughs> but he is there all the time so it's Argentina who has won the World Cup of 2022 <laughs> so thank you guys for watching my penalty reaction if you guys like my reaction if you guys like my videos please don't forget to subscribe and answer. thumbs up our videos and share with your friends see you guys in the club football in January with La Liga with Premier League Champions League until those matches until those Real Madrid matches until those Champions League matches Ciao.